about what we have made it unequivocally clear that you cannot put your boot on our neck and then say, let us stop. It is free men and women that negotiate, not prisoners. All the examples that you've given, the circumstances were different. In Kenya, the opposition was not being stifled and being called for talks. You will not speak to a dictator unless when you are in a strong position to speak. We believe in dialogue. But again, we're not going to dialogue with wild animals. The regime in Uganda is clearly behaving like wild animals. Uh, it's rather laughable to talk about negotiations when our people are being abducted, tortured, and murdered on a daily, when there's absolute disrespect of human rights and the rule of law. So there is no and will be no talks when the atmosphere is continuously like that.